we went to Kohl's and I did a couple exchanges, got a t-shirt. I'm kind of pissed because my mom got me the same t-shirt and I love it. But um, I went back to get it in the same size she got me. It, it don't fit. Like I need a, a bigger one. It's not a maternity shirt, you know. I know I got bigger. Thank you, Miles. I'm just so that. sweet. And then I had to get this like giant bra, which it feels so great to have like a finally a bra that fits. But it's just disheartening to know that like I'm that big now. Like this is the biggest bra. I'm not gonna tell y'all, but it's the biggest bra I've ever had in oh, my man, life. Let them know. Let them I'm not know. telling people my business like that. No, they don't need to be knowing what I'm working with. I'm getting so big. Like I'm really feeling it right now. And I'm tired and sluggish, but that's also the anemia. So hopefully I, I can hope get. I you got juice from when we actually inside of H and M. Yeah, I have juice, Miles. Benny Birth. You oh wait. Call, you need to call your vlog the Kirsten Car Show. Cause I be in the car, Miles. Right. So vlog when you out the car. You don't live in a car. Yes, I do. Oh, y'all see my baby girl? Can you see her? Oh my gosh. I'm like super excited. So yeah, so. No, you can cop out. You can put it on me because you are comfortable with all these people. I'm not uncomfortable with the people. It's not that. It's just I don't want to fall and bust my butt. Like I'm up here like trying to vlog and, and then I fall and like bust my booty. I don't want I want that to happen. Huh? Because you're so much better to look at than me. Oh yeah, now you know you feel pretty. Yo, they opened the H and M here though. I'm super excited. I feel like there's some kind of controversy with H and M, but I can't remember. Don't tell me, because then I'm not gonna come back. But I'm still gonna buy stuff because it's like super cheap. So yeah. <laughs> I ain't got no loyalties. <laughs> well, I'm kind of glad. I think the men's side is on the other side, so we'll enter the other side because I've already spent my portion of money for today. Okay, so we are in Toys R Us. We've got our gun and we're ready to go, right? Right, right. Daddy? Let's do this. Okay, so the very first thing, I know we're like out of order, but we really want to find strollers because last time this was really embarrassing. We did not know how to do strollers. Ooh, man, can I start now? I definitely want these UV things. These are so good for babies, the UV things. But now I got to figure out, because we have a small car, which one do we need? So yeah, uh, we just finished. I don't know if you guys can see me, but we just finished um, you doing. You, you don't want to uh, stay. Just go to um, take Kai and go to uh, local peasant. Oh, we could do that. We gotta call her. I don't know if she's in for the night. Call her. Okay. Um. Well, anyways, we just finished the baby shower. Baby shower. Ugh. The baby registry for Ella. It was so exhausting and confusing. 
and I feel like we got a bunch of stuff and I just hope that you know we get it <laughs> and you know I just hope it's stuff that she needs you know being a first-time parent I just I really wish I had like my mom here or my mother-in-law or some other mothers that like friends of mine who are mothers because I just I want to I want to have I'm the type of person I like to have the necessities I don't like excess and we live in you know we have an apartment so we don't have a space to kind of have a lot of stuff and I don't I want my child to have her stuff you know in the house but I I want it to I don't want it to become like baby land when people come over it's all you see is baby 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 you know like I I want it to be you know oh these people have a baby but it's not completely taken over by my baby if that makes sense we're gonna go get some food and call it a night. I'm probably not going to vlog anymore today because I am just so tired. We had a full day and then tomorrow um, is a relaxation day which we probably won't vlog at all. So, see you guys next week. Bye. Good morning. So we are at our hotel um, this morning and having breakfast at the breakfast buffet. And there was something interesting on this breakfast buffet that Miles is going to try. We are not going to try it because it's a little too adventurous right now. I have no problems being adventurous, just not right now. I'm gonna be eating uh, some preserved duck eggs. Apparently this uh, is a pickle. Which is which? That's the pickled one? Uh, I think this is the pickled one. And what's that one? You don't have this silverware? This is the preserved one. No, I'm just showing you. This is the shell here. So I'm going to have to, I won't be able to just pop it in my mouth. I'm going to have to be a little careful. This is the shell here. I, think you, I don't think you should just plop anything in your mouth. I think you should just take a bite. Like, you use a fork or something. Here's the shell for the other one. Okay, alright, so go for it. Let's see it. Which one should I start with? Black one. Start with the black one. <laughs> little bites, Miles. Huh? I said little bites. Oh, God. Oh. Little bites. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> well, <laughs> what's it taste like, Mo? <laughs> What did it taste like? Was it pickled? It was so different. The consistency was like a, uh, you know those super bouncy balls? Yeah. I felt like I was eating when I, like I was chewing on a super bouncy ball. How do you know what that tastes like, Miles? I don't know what it tastes like, but that's the consistency of it. Like that, you know. Okay, quit song. Next one. And they're gonna say, well, we're going to pay. Okay. You're already tasting it. And maybe take a smaller bite this time. Maybe. No, we. No, of the, of the other one. Now, I know that that black part, the yolk, did you try that? Yeah. There was an after. You want to wait and do get some water and maybe do it again? I'll take a sip of this coffee. All right, so this is round two. Miles in the egg. Oh. Such a big bite. <laughs> Ruined your whole breakfast, didn't it? It might be the saltiest thing I ever had in my life. Oh, it's salty? It's so, yeah. It's just nice. Let me show you the other one. He took it out of the shell. It's black. 
So it's like, okay. Good morning. It is Wednesday. And here's my little outfit. I love this bow that I made. Did you guys see it? I got this off of um, Natural's tutorial of her style channel, how to make your own. So if you haven't already, check it out. Maybe I'll put the link in the comment box below, but it's really super easy. And I should make more now that I have short hair. I feel like I need more hair accessories. <sighs> I'm getting dressed. I'm not really done. I'm going to put my contacts on. Got my ring for my grandma. Grandma's bracelet. Wedding ring. I'm wearing this top. Let me turn around. This maternity top that my mom made. Ooh, this mirror is dirty too, but this is not my bathroom. So, yeah. So this maternity top. It's kind of short, so we're going to see how long we can get. And then there's Ella, so you can kind of see her. And just some leggings. So, yeah, so today, oops, got raggedy slippers. Ignore them. Today, I made banana nut bread. Mm, yummy. Yes, so I made banana nut bread. It is hot in here because anytime I use this oven, the whole place gets hot. Oh, and this is my fridge. You guys never get to see my fridge. Oh, I don't want to show you pictures of my baby, but grandma and grandpa. I got to get some more pictures. Yeah, my measuring information. So if you ever measure, it's my parents. And then it's my cousin-in-law and family. So yeah. So today I'm going to um, head out, get some stuff for a client, do some tutoring, and I'll see you guys tonight. Bye. All right, I'm back. We're still here on Saturday. And um, I'm wearing this dress. You know, the one thing about this pregnancy is like, Look at my boobs. I mean, I'm not trying to tell y'all to look at my boobs, but I mean, honestly, look at them. I didn't need any help, and I just bought this new bra, and you can already tell it's starting to be too small. And this is like, like three cup sizes bigger than what I normally wear. And not cup sizes, it's three, no, it's two cup sizes up. And the around the waistband is um, two inches up. So, and it looks like, as you can see, it's already too small. And I just bought this last week. But yeah, here's baby girl. And we are 23 weeks and two days. So 23 weeks and two days. She's growing. I'm just wearing this cute dress from Forever 21. A little cheap dress I got a while ago. My do-it-yourself headband. Hoops from Grandma. Ring. Grandma's ring. Some flip-flops from Big Lots. And I'm going to get a pedicure. Oh, I just can't get over it. I feel like I look like Dolly Parton. This is just not cute. And then, yeah, a stain. Well, it's not a stain. It's just water, but, you know... I'm really clumsy, and I put a little bit of mascara on. Can you all see? Just a little bit. So I just left Pure Nail Salon on Ventura Boulevard. So this is Ventura Boulevard, obviously. And um, I got my toes done. Look, baby girl's toes. Yes. I have not had a pedicure since my wedding last year. So. This was a really special treat for me. And uh, I'm really excited um, to do this. I think I want to get it done in another month because toenail polish lasts a long time, but I do spend a lot of time on my feet. So I feel like I need to get this done at least once a month. Because it wasn't too expensive. I mean, for an organic nail salon, it's pretty good. So where where is this though? Oh, well, I gotta find a place where to have ice. So, I don't know where we are, but we're at City Walk. People's rude children keep knocking me over. But it's all good. We out here. I'm hot. Miles just had me walk up the hill instead of catch the trolley. It's all good, you know. Gotta get my exercise in. 
I'm breathing like a pregnant lady. Oh gosh. Okay. So, yeah. So yeah, we out here Labor Day weekend. What's this? That's what I do right here. Oh, you know what I've never done? 